Marrakesh Caribbean is the best. Hey, up against the test, Caribbean inside is the best. Hey, Caribbean inside is the best. Better than the rest. Hey, hey, and your new tube. <laughs> hey, so don't find me rude. This is the movement of our people, our history, and our culture to the world. Direct from Trinidad, Calypso superstar Baron. Professionally, I started in 1971. My first hit was severe licking to the public short election. Entered the competition for the first time and came third. I was the his bomber and cypher who said, This is shorty beating and kill the other day. With me, Calypsonian, I was made to understand. Put a severe licking on the woman. But in front of everybody, I hear shorty lick she. Oh, God. Lick she. Oh, Jesus. Lick she. Was lick to she face, lick to she waist. He lick off his as she paid to place. And he lick she. Oh, God. Lick she.
was your first time in the business? Well, not first time in singing, but first year in Calypso. Tell me a little bit about what went on with you after that, in that same Calypso arena. Um, I started touring with Ed Watson for a while. And then I went back to Trinidad. I went to a couple of the islands, the West Indian islands. I went back to Trinidad, continued singing like in nightclubs and different shows and so. And that was about it for that for that year. Lady, lady, I want to dance with you tonight. Why, lady, lady, give me a chance to hold you. Let me show you how much I love you, how much I'm thinking about you. I've been watching you, I've been watching you, lady, I've been watching you, watching you, lady, lady. I like the sexy way you walk. Why, hey, lady, lady, the kind of sexy way you talk. Let's jump the night out with baby. You want me personally in a decent way. Lady, we could break away, break, break away. away. Lady, 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 oh my lady, my my lady, lady, my sweet lady. Get up, DD. International. When you started, like besides singing in the islands, as you say, when you started coming out, I first I started off about five years of age singing. Started in church, doing well, my my parents is Baptist, so of course I am a Baptist. I used to sing like rhythm and blues. I used to sing calypso, but not my own. Or I used to sing like Sparrow, Shorty, and these guys calypso on different shows. And the night I sang The Slave by Sparrow and Shorty Hood, and he said to me, boy, why you don't sing Calypso? I say, I prefer to listen or sing other people Calypso than to really sing Calypso, forgive me. So I, um, I said to him, I say, okay, you want me to sing Calypso? Right to. And I will sing them. So this is how he came up with Sivir Likin, which is Shorty Likshi, mm -hmm. and the flip side was too late. Mm. And this, this is how I came out in the Thank you. 
our culture and our people to the world. Now remember to wear your mask, take care of yourself and each other. My name is David Rudder. I am Mavis John. Yo, this is KMC. I'm Nicole Graves. Hey, this is Ronnie. This is Ronnie McIntosh. I is Brother Resistance. I am Ras Shorty Eyes. I make sure that I watch Caribbean Inside. And so should you. Caribbean Inside. Ready is dynamite. Caribbean Insight, really super, for spite, Caribbean Insight, enjoy day or night, Caribbean Insight, really is dynamite. Thank you for making Caribbean Insight your number one stop for culture. Today we have over 10,000 subscribers. You have showed your interest in keeping Caribbean culture alive. We are offering you our t-shirt collections. Shirts that invoke thoughts and empowerment. They are collector's items and memorabilia. For your participation, go to the link below and make your contribution to foster the value of our Caribbean cultural stories. Thank you for your support as we continue to develop. I'm the Lord Kitchen. This is Rootsman. This is Sunel Demsa. My name is Winston Bailey, better known as Shadow. This is Calypsonian Squeezy. I watch no other but Caribbean. As your first time when you enter in the Big Ten, with the big guns, men like Sparrow you're talking about and Shorty, for, for those of you who don't know, those are some of the great Calypsonians out of Trinidad and Tobago. How did you feel? Well, to be truthful, when I first used to, Sparrow was one of my, was not one, but he was my biggest idol. Shorty, composer and these guys. And um, I used to really sing with them on shows before I end up in the Calypso tent. But I used to always say from, a, from um, a kid that one good day I have to be on stage with the Mighty Sparrow mm. and most of the top Calypsonians. So the year when I came out with Severe Licking, Shorty took me to Sparrow's original Young Brigade. That was on Rice Road. Right, the seamen and waterfront workers. Mm -hmm. And he said he went to Sparrow and tell them that uh, the, not even not Sparrow but Sil Taylor who was the manager. And he said to them that I'm bringing my little brother to sing Calypso. So they wanted to hear what the little brother have to offer. Right. So this is how I started off with severe licking. When I sang the first verse and chorus, they, they stopped me from singing and tell me they didn't want to hear no more. <laughs> so much trouble in the world today. Too much, too much I say. 
Tell me what is the world coming to? What can we say or do? What is going to happen to the human race? Can't we see what's taking place? Don't they know that? Love conquers all. Don't they know? Don't they know? Love conquers all. Don't they know? Don't they know? Calypso straight through from 1971? No, I didn't. I sang in 1971 for the first time Calypso. And I stayed off after that for 13 years. But I used to be singing still. In shows and touring with Ed Watson. And then uh, Shorty came and he had his band. They called the Vibration International with Ella Andal and myself, Gail McLean. Lalji, and we had a nice little side, and I started in 1976. I started um, 
traveling with everybody talking about rehabilitation while endless atrocities spreading through the nation amendments debate said on the radio station but what have they contribute to my fallen nation Consort with corrupt action And our lives Have become a knife in display Of pretense, prejudice and endless dismay Oh, 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 oh. I want you to find yourself Put it up
Caribbean viewers, thank you for checking out CaribbeanInsideTV.com and visiting our stores. Remember, your contribution is vital to the Caribbean cultural revolution. Thank you for watching.